It will be easier to wean a parrot from screaming if you understand the reason for this behavior. There can be many such reasons, so the first thing to do is to rule out health problems. Pain and discomfort are often the reasons for the bird's bad behavior, and a consultation with an ornithologist will not be superfluous. Most often parrots scream from boredom. If a dog is left home alone without toys, it will bark and howl. It's the same with birds. A bored parrot sings to get attention or simply to express its displeasure. Another reason is the opposite, your pet may scream from overexcitement. This often happens when there is a noisy atmosphere at home and the parrot is stressed. The habit of making noise may catch up with your pet during the mating season. Usually, with time, the behavior will normalize again. Many birds scream as they greet the morning. In that case, simply accept the pet for who he is and let him enjoy the new day. But what to do if the parrot cries not only in the morning or when he is bored, but almost constantly? Some varieties of birds by nature are very noisy and it makes no sense to retrain them. However, there are a few secrets that will help you at least slightly correct the behavior or achieve silence. Let's list the main ones. How do you wean a parrot from screaming? Make sure that the conditions you create are suitable for the parrot. Is he comfortable in the cage, is everything enough for him? Is he hungry or thirsty? Any discomfort may cause the parrot to scream. Put as many different toys as possible in the parrot's cage, within reason, so that they do not interfere with its movement. A playful parrot will not annoy the owners with noise. Alternate and renew toys from time to time, so that the pet doesn't lose interest in them. Let the parrot fly around the apartment every day, so he can stretch his wings and release the accumulated energy. Do not forget to close windows and keep a close eye on the bird so it will walk safely. Allow the parrot to make plenty of noise in the morning and evening. Birds love to squawk as they greet sunrise or sunset. If you don't disturb them in doing so, you'll have a good chance of enjoying the silence during the day and at night. Pay attention to your pet. Talk and play with your pup more often, train him, teach him different tricks, and teach him how to talk. When the parrot receives the owner's attention, it will not beg for it with a wild howl. Talk to the parrot in muted tones and teach it to whistle softly. The parrot will quiet down to hear you better and begin to imitate your measured speech. Never shout at the bird. Can you guess why? No, not just because such punishment is completely ineffective. Rather, on the contrary. Hearing your yelling, the bird will imitate your behavior and try to shout you down. Don't forget that a frightened or agitated bird makes a very loud noise. Encourage good behavior and ignore bad behavior. If your parrot didn't scream while you were out of the room, give him a treat. Conversely, if your parrot screams in an attempt to get your attention, ignore his behavior. In this case, even your displeased facial expression can be an encouragement to him, not to mention a loud intonation. The best solution is to leave the room in silence. At first, be prepared for increased shouting and have patience. When the parrot realizes that his yelling has no effect on you, he will calm down. Return to the room as soon as the parrot stops screaming and has been quiet for at least 10 seconds. Do not leave the bird in complete silence, provide it with white noise. As an option, turn on the TV. The main thing is not loud. Contrary to what most people think, nature sounds are better to avoid, if the parrot hears the cry of another bird, it will start making even more noise. Control the light regime. Avoid bright lights in the room where the parrot's cage stands. At night, do not forget to cover the cage with a thick cloth. As a rule, parrots need 10 to 12 hours of sleep at night. Be consistent and patient. Remember, patience and hard work will do it all. But do not expect from your pet the impossible. Birds by nature are quite noisy creatures, they communicate by shouting, express their approval or displeasure this way, and you have to learn to accept it. Good luck in the educational process and good friendship with the bird.